What's up, my dudes? How's it going? Today, Zach Blake here, and today I'm just gonna do a little bit of talking because I wanted to share some advice on you guys. Now, um, this title is called School Sucks, and because I just want to lay down a little bit of knowledge. Now, a lot of you guys, uh, are not in college, and I'm in college, and one of the dream things I wanted to do was, like, when I was in high school, I thought, what if I just like, scheduled my things in college to where I could just have, like, a bunch of days off or, you know, just have a really cool schedule. Now, and I mean, right now, yourself, if you were thinking of a perfect schedule for school, how would you do it? You'd probably be like, okay, maybe minimal, minimal days at school and then maximum days, you know, off of school, right? Or maybe have an easy day where you wake up later. That's kind of the big thing is like, hey, I'll, I'd rather wake up, like, at, at 10 and then go into school instead of, like, you know, 7 and then going at 8 and, like, kind of thing. But, see, what I did this semester is I kind of, you know, lived out that, like, dream. I was like, you know, I'm going to schedule everything to try to be on one day. And the way that college works, or at least with mine, is I'll schedule... Uh, classes and then I can schedule the time like oh I pick that class that class is from Monday Wednesday and Friday from one to two so I can pick classes that have certain schedules and so what I did was I saw that most of my classes that I needed to take were you know only on Wednesday like I had I had to do a lab a laboratory for geology and so I was like okay this class is from nine until 11 50 so 9 a.m to 11 50 and I was like huh, okay, well, that's only on Wednesday. Why don't I just make everything on Wednesday? Today, having a long day, 13 hours, I just finally parked. I woke up at 6, left my house at 6.30. It is now 8.04. That is a long drive and a long thing of parking that has taken forever, but... I have class at 9, so I do have an hour to get ready, but I have class today from 9 a.m. to 9.45 p.m. Can we do this? And uh, this is where I made the big mistake. I made, basically, <laughs> I made my entire week Wednesday. So I go to school from 9 a.m. to 9.45 p.m. So from the morning all the way to the night. That's a full, like, 12-hour day and 45 minutes, you know, add on. But it doesn't just stop there, you know? Because I have to wake up at 6.30 to beat the traffic and get a parking spot to be there, you know? So I gotta get wake up at 6.30, drive all the way over there to get there by, like, 8-ish to get a parking spot. And then I have to wait and then finally go to class at 9 and then don't stop going to class until 9.45 where I have to do the entire thing again of driving all the way back home to barely get home by 10 30. now that is what ruins my day because on tuesday i'm preparing for wednesday wednesday happens i'm literally destroyed all day it's like i can't even concentrate i'm listening to lectures and it's just so boring by the time you you've done seven hours of school you're like okay i'm mentally done by the time you do 12 hours of school you're just it's just over. So by the time I get to, you know, nine o'clock, <laughs> it's been like almost 16 hours since I woke up. So it, it is horrible. And I've recorded some like videos that you've probably been seeing throughout here that I've spliced through. Um, but I thought in the beginning that this was going to be super cool because on Monday I have a super easy day. It's like 12 to two Tuesday, no school. Wednesday, that's the day. Thursday, no school. Friday, one hour. It's like 12 to 12.50. But because I scheduled it all on Wednesday, I've had midterms just up my butt on Wednesday. And it, it is just, it's horrible. Going 12 hours to school, taking tests for the whole 12 hours. And it's like, oh, if you finish early, you get to leave the class. Yeah, but then I have to wait an hour still for my class, next class to begin. So it, I'm just, I'm just saying this advice now. The best schedule that you should ever assign yourselves if you ever go to college is just split up. Like, you can have a class start at 10 and then end, maybe you end your day at, like, 2 or something like that. But make that, like, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Now, that's simple. If you want to make it even better, probably do, you know, Tuesday and Thursday. But that's, like, eh, it's kind of still long as well. But Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If you can somehow get a schedule where you're just three days of the week and it's all split out evenly... 
That's the best. Because right now, it's like I'm by myself the entire day waiting for the next classes to begin. Trying to think of ideas for videos. And um, yeah, it, it's it's a very packed schedule. And I don't know. School sucks just more than that. Because you get the teachers who are very passionate. And then you get the, pe the teachers that don't really care. I know there's a lot of teachers in high school and middle school that literally have no idea what they're talking about. And when you get to college and stuff, you notice how everybody knows what they're talking about. Because they're a doctor doctor they have doctorates in their study so I mean when you get to college you learn a lot more but it's uh it gets harder because just these past weeks I was like I'm gonna record a bunch of stuff and then my teachers were like no no you're not here's two midterms here's three ter uh, term papers here's four essays in class here's this here's homework here's projects I have to go on field trips for geology it, it's it's crazy. And so I, I hope that when you guys get to, you know, college or if you guys are in college right now that you're having a good time because not only like is this happening, I feel like I'm not really having too much fun in college. I'm having the fun outside of college, just, you know, hanging out with friends and stuff, doing YouTube, you know, talking to you guys. So I hope that you guys have the best out of college and stuff. And I hope you have the best out of high school and middle school and everything beyond because the whole thing about enjoying school is... uh it's very important because, you know, you kind of just go through school waiting for the next year. I know a lot of you are probably just waiting for next year because it'll probably be better. But if you think about the good things that are happening in this year, that's when it becomes a good year. Think of all the friends that you have now while you're hanging out, all of the niches that you're in, you know, doing your thing. It could be pretty fun. You just got to think of the positive things. Regardless of if school's hard, some teachers may suck. That happens, but... We'll get through them. So, I hope everybody's having a good old day. And I hope maybe this cheers some people up. <laughs> knowing that I'm I'm going through some uh, tough schooling myself. But, uh, <laughs> I uh, just want to make this little video. And, uh, hopefully, this, uh, this was cool for you guys. So, thank you guys for watching. And, as always, peace out, my dudes. <laughs>